Alright. Alright, um, is your car too thirsty for gas? Learn how to run your car on water. Legal disclaimer, this book has been ended to revise content clarity, detects readability, technology, suitable for the modern fuel injection, old carburetor based vehicles, and inspired with the original um original public domain hydrostar conversion plans. Bleated by the conversion may be measurable measurably modify the exhaust characteristics of your vehicle. Therefore, we strongly advise the content of your local and local, um, national governing body regulators to verify the compliance with existing emission requirements and standards. We also encourage to verify the vehicle state of the government emission test after completing the conversion. All these plans are designed um, to be 100% reversible to work with the vast majority of the motor vehicles you're acknowledging. You acknowledge the understanding that by carrying out these plans, you're assuming the responsibility of potential risk and damage of the incidental consequence relating to the result from use and misuse of this plan. Furthermore, you understand that the inherent risk relating to the exploratory and pioneer mechanical technology. All right, preface, or the contents. Preface, contents, basic, what is the answer? What is the hybrid, water hybrid system? What is the water hybrid perpetual motion system? What is the hybrid um, system safe? Is the water hybrid system safe? What are the, why is the hybrid um, water hybrid system called a conversion system? Why, or how well does the water hybrid system perform? Can a water hybrid system go used in other ways? Is the water hybrid system um, difficult to build? And can I build it ready? And can I buy it ready to install a water hybrid system? The water hybrid system hydrogen oxygen generated water tank tank and pump. The dash indicators optional hydrotonics module generated electrical circuit schematic. Um, generator uh, coil circuit schematic in dash indicator circuit schematic. Let's build the water hybrid system generator construction electrodes housing list of materials step by step direction illustration housing attachment unthreaded end ca cap list of materials material source. We encourage the re research try to you Google your own source sources. We can not guarantee these sources will offer the best prices available always available. Direction sloth shield flame arrestor. Water level switch test, to toroid coil, list of materials, material sources, director, directions, toroid coil installation, unthreaded end cap insulation, generator field assembly, generator final assembly, in dash indicator panel assembly, list of material, material source, directions, water tank and pump, list of material, material source and directions, hydro tank module, mist materials, list of material source and directions, fuel injector carburetor adapter, auto assembly, list of materials, material sources, and direction preliminary assemble testing cylinder head temperature final assemble testing health head ends maintenance cold weather operation space generator good good old good old stainless steel good old JB weld keep a close watch G Arts gauge reference and a thought of thought or two. All right, basic question and answer. The good starting point with the understanding of the water hybrid technology and the answer variety of the frequently asked questions you may have. So here we go. What is the water hybrid system? The water hybrid system is essentially covered with the vehicle, the use of the water source for the supplementary, even even theoretically primary fuel. The engine derived with the fuel from the hydrogen and oxygen generated with electrosis of the water. Although the petroleum derived with the fuel and electro, external electrical generating system is not theoretically required, it must serve circumstances and unpractical necessity. The only prior product resulting from the hydrogen and oxygen component with the combustion with the engine and the water vapor, the emission is usually clear and emitting the fewer polluting particles. In short, the water hybrid system is Clean, cleaner and system with one that drives supplemental fuel with the free with the inexhaustible resource water inexhaustible resource water is un ununique for the advantage of the being able to remove pollutants from the air d during combustion even in the reduce the carbon residue within the engine similar to the effect of the higher octane fuel the wire hybrid system has proven that it has been implemented in various forms and variety of the engineering mechanics hobbies for the round of the world it is end of the result of the ma um, many of the year for the testing experimental with a multiple loot hydrogen generating System based on the principle of electrosis of water. Water system, electrical system, similarly uh, simply produced on down in the water in the basic hydrogen oxygen atoms passing electronic current through it. You don't even have to have an electrical. Uh, you don't even have to have electrolyte such as acid to the water to ensure the electrical conductivity is required with the, with the battery. Plain old tap water works fine because it contains the new, new natural electrolytes such as minerals. Also, municipal add additives such as chlorine, which will also aid electrical conductivity. In fact, electrosis is in many ways similar to the reaction occurred with the vehicle's battery. Electrosis of water and no nothing new. It was the first accomplished in the year of the century ago, but until the technology of the water hybrid system was developed, it required the high voltage power supply with the consume the various vast amounts of electrical energy. Actually, required much more electrical energy than the energy derived with the combustion result of the hydrogen and oxygen. Um, in other words, extremely inefficient, inefficient um, process has been a limited practice use.
The water hybrid system is a practical solution to develop with the fuel injected with the carbureted motor to cycle it with the water hybrid system live in the hydronic module to produce relatively low voltage, unique shaped electrical pulse and precise um, frequency duration, overall power consumption in the hydronic module, the entire with the water hybrid system very slow, low, but the actual low level enough to um, easily power with the vehicle, the successful electrical Excess electrical heat output they will enough to resorb the power left to help run all the vehicles other electrical devices. Is is with the water hybrid system a perpetual motion machine? The water hybrid system is not a perpetual motion steam, high efficiency water fuel electromechanical system capable of producing hydrogen and oxygen in sufficient quantity to improve the overall fuel efficiency with the internal combustion engine. If the water hybrid system is safe, the vehicle powers by the water hydro, hydro hybrid system are inherently safer than the hydrogen powered vehicles, which requires hydrogen tanks. Instead the hydrogen tank, the water hybrid system exact, extracts combustible hydrogen, uh, hydrogen as needed from the water, as in steady with the release of the hydrogen and burn continuously, continuously, thereby preventing larger accumulation of hydrogen gas. Why? What is the wide water hydrogen hydrogen system called the conversion by called? Why is the conversion system? Water hybrid system is called the conversion system because it does not require removal of the modification, disabling any of the vehicle's existing system. Therefore, it allows you to run the car either 100% gasoline system over the water. Or one or water hybrid system. It's unlikely eventually water hybrid fail that you can. It's unlikely that even though that the water hybrid fails, you can easily switch back to the sole solely using gas power. But you, you'll soon getting. She'll be getting water hybrid back in the working order. Once you have driven di driven with the water hybrid system, you'll never be happier any else with anything else. How do, uh, well does the water hybrid system work? The um, vehicles powered by the water hybrid system are theoretically capable of traveling 50 to 300 miles of each way on supplemental water with improving overall fuel efficiency up to 45%. However, it is true that the engine actual efficiency depends on many of the factors such as driving, how the terrain, weight, vehicle weight, shape, and ability to um, treat, tweak and optimize the system. Call the water, calling the water air hybrid system we even other ways. If the water hybrid system can provide with the fuel water system just any of the home appliance requiring with the natural gas of the propane source, thereby saving the um, valuable diminishing natural resources, space heat of the furnishes that are ex excellent can stove and other cooking units such as barbecue grills can also be fueled with a water hybrid system. Such applications require the spe um, separate power um, supply to convert the homes to 120 volt AC power into the 12 volt DC power required by the hybrid water hybrid system. You can purchase the excessive power supply with the electronics store with the radio shack. Have someone unfamiliar with electronics build one build one for you since the design is very simple. The cost of the home electricity you use by the water hybrid system is insignificant, probably less than three dollars per month in most cases. Is the water hybrid system difficult to build? No matter, no, the water hybrid system is relatively easy to assemble, the very easily installed, and especially with the bear with the other, uh, with other conversion plans for the other market. No special tools are required. The usual tool equipment found with the typical home of the workshop they will do the assembly of the hydrotonic module achieve with the inherent the high level of reliability. Requires cares and attention to details along with the average electronic skill. The only special with the test equipment that you might you want to have excessive use is an oscillope. oscillope. It is not necessary. You may have to obtain the peak of efficiency for the hydrotonic mo modules. You may, but you should you should have any problem getting away from the local electronics guru that do. You do not have the oscillope um, scope. Most folks that have tonight with the unusual electrical system devices that they would um, almost be willing to pay you for the privilege of tweaking your hydrotronics module. Can I buy a ready to install water hybrid system? Right now, the specific water hybrid system is not being commercially manufactured, but there are very distributors. There are very distributors around the country who offer the do-it-yourself parts or fully assembled kits using similar technology and principles. Planning at the initial stage of the part, producing water hybrid conversion of the kits for most vehicles, eventually manufacture the entire system and leave without major components. Where we're hoping that some of the prototype kit kits um, tested and delivered, ready to install the kit, should be installed sometime before the end of the 2008. However, the years you'll soon be building your own. Right, the water hybrid system. Figure 18 of the book that depicts some of the core of the water hybrid system, which each of the components is essential for the operation of the heart of the system. The hydrogen and oxygen generates for the conversion of the water into the combustible gas fuel with the power of the engine. The water tank of the pump of the so store then supply water for the generator. Simple electronic signal for the hydrotonic module to initiate the sustained creation of the hydrogen and oxygen within the generator. And in the dash gauge indicator with the assembly allow the accurately, accurately monitor all the aspects of the water hybrid system and every part of the water hybrid system is regularly designed reliable operation operation along and safe, um, long, reliable operation along life. Let's take a close take look at each of the part, um, part of the system, basic understanding how everything works. 
the hydrogen oxygen generator. Preferring to figure one of the and page of the hydrogen oxygen generator houses the round cylinder construct with the temperature for the CPVC pipe, the can material to be used for the building, industrial plumbing system, CPVC pipe is extremely durable, temperature for the tolerant, and it's always safe for the friendly material with the easy to work with it and it can be used with a fabricate each of the things such as furniture planners, hose um housing, just about anything and everything. Um, the generator housing contains a basic oil with a two cylindrical, cylindrical electrode that can generate with both hydrogen and oxide. Each of them can be made with a variety of material with the stainless steel and the ceramic, but also very durable materials. However, the two automatic different forms of the hydrogen are produced with the, within the generator. Most generator hydrogen is the ortho hydrogen, a very powerful, fast burning gas created with the two electrodes. Precisely controlled high frequency electrical signal from the hydronics module activates and controls the electrodes. Other than that, the hydrogen par hydrogen is created by the coal in as much as the less quantity of the, of the ortho hydrogen and precisely controlled very low frequency electrical signal from a separate circuit with a hydrotonic module that activates and controls the coil. Pyrohydrogen is less powerful and slower back burning gas. Um, but not, but it's necessary to prevent pre-combustion, commonly known as knocking, within your engine. Power hydrogen show with the burning rate of the hydrogen mixed with the boosting with the octane level. This one of the precise controls all allows you the exact match with the engine octane octane requirement that raise the octane level in gasoline. Specific additives must be used. To slow the burning rate, the best for the in, in, in existence science it depends on the try, trying um the average of the octane requirement for the milieu of the engines. Typical speaking, hydrogen oxygen generated itself with an electronic base with the two electrodes um, from a basic capacitor a thousand of the times larger than the capacitor. You have the typical cir two cir typical circuits when the water acting with um, dielectrical, the inner electrical the inner electrode is negative charge, and the outer electrode is positive charge. The end of the high frequency of the hydrotronic signal with a chemically at uh, water molecule HCO is completed, composed of the two positive charged atoms of the hydrogen, one negatively charged uh, one uh, uh, atom of oxygen, some since the op op opposite charges attract the positive charge of the hydrogen atoms are pulled toward the inner electrode, but some uh, at the same instant of the negatively charged oxygens are pulled outward toward the outer electrode. The um, action aligned with every water molecule between the electrode with the, and with the end of the, each molecule being pulled in the opposite direction. In that cell hydro hydro hydrosilis process central hydrogen extraction. All right, this shows your... Um, Top of your uh, hydrogen and oxygen generator. Show the pressure relief valve, the pressure to the pressure gauge, and to the engine. Your water level switch and slosh get guard, and then a water level. Okay, and hydrogen oxygen bubbles coil indicate in connector pins. Um, coil, outer co electro, um, inner electrode, water inlet check valve, electro connector pins, and drain cock. For brief for brief moments, only a more accurate alignment that increases the bubbling action pump with the water molecule of the, or by the hydrotronics of the signal power for the keeping the water um, charging water capacitor with the higher and higher voltage on volt level. The actual several thousand volt so the electrical force become with the greater the water mo molecules burst and apart with the scientists and all of this disassociation. In this gas here from the high and this form there are gaseous forms hydrogen and oxygen it were able to learn that generative action of this because of the formulation of the million of the hydrogen and oxygen gas bubbles along with the hydrotonic cycle is applied with the water capacity remains fully charged and continues with the creation of ortho hydrogen and oxygen another electrical um circle the form with the generator core with the inductive circuit with the meaning with the creative the magnetic field of the pope with the charge field with the created with the water by the water capacitor the very low frequency of the hydrotronic signal with the actually short pulse actually activates the magnetic field with the coil with the, as soon as the pulse stop the magnetic field Field collapses, creates an even stronger magnetic field. The field opposite with the polarity that's how the inductive circuit that wor secret works. Action commonly called inductive kick. Each pulse is precisely timed almost immediately after the magnetic field reverses. After the short pulse has arrived, that once again the coil is recharged, is charged, and magnetic field collapses. But now, now the continuing reverse of magnetic field becomes even with the stronger due to the additive injury of engine energy of the new pulse. Eventually, actually, within a few seconds, the coil reaches the maximum maximum mag magnetic strength and called the, called the saturation point. All right, most molecules are affected by the magnetic field of the coil is reversing magnetic fiber of the water molecule vigorously with the disassociation with the gaseous forms of the perohydrogen and oxygen. Disassociation observably occurred with the scene with the creation of a million of the hydrogen and oxygen gas bubbles in the coil. At this point, we are converted with the concept with the need to understand the basic function of the generator, each valve of their component with the water hybrid system, and simply precisely the control of the action of the generator. But varying strength with the frequency, hydronic um, signal of the rate with the hydrogen and oxygen is created 
with the variable the match with each of them, the requirement of the particular movement of the water supply with the tank of the pump, while the water level, the generator is controlled with the level sensor, switch player safety per, um, purpose of the relief valve, protect against the uh, excess pressure below with the generator. Separate ports are provided with the attaching hose to route the gas into the engine, the optional gauge with the monitoring gas for pressure with the build up within the generator. Drain valve with the insert with the install with the allowed periodic flushing of the accumulated minerals and contamination. Contaminants at the bottom end of the cap there is so the generator can also be ended up with the inspection repair. Okay. Additional cleaning of the electrodes and coal, two pairs of stainless steel copper, and any conductive metal with rod ends. Protrude from the generator body to fill, um, provide with electrical connection with electrodes and coal with the hydrotronics um, module. All right, shown figure eight, figure 18 with the generator gap output with the hose connection for the flame arrestor, which when the turn connect for the burst fed, fitting attached to the engine. The flame arrestor provides protection against the combustion flash back into the generator in the event where the engine backfiring occurs. As the generator, the rest body, arrestor body and correct, um, construct with the TB PVC pipe to the simple of using a small diameter of the pipe and end caps with the hose fitting stuff that, um, stuffed in stainless steel wool. The pressure and fitting of the kit, the kits are readily available to the engine house shop. They are designed converting with the engine to the road to run on propane so that they are perfectly adaptable to the wire hybrid system. It is recommended to install the generator engine compartment that is going to be installed just about anywhere in space permits in the vehicle, even in the trunk. But even everything is simplified, um, simplified by placing it near the engine since for the minimizing the road. Routing, housing, um, routing houses and gauge lines, electrical wiring, water tank and pump. Obviously, the simplest part of the whole system is just about the large container will hold the water with the well recommended in a particular tank with the wind. With given the construction favor, they are endless for the save with a few bucks there. And while they're building the water hybrid system, but I don't recommend the cutting corner with expensive. At the expense of the quality, the entire system is designed to be highly reliable. So, when chain with the missing things, um, when the, so why take the chance of messing things up by going cheap? For example, I recommend installing water level sensors in the water tank so you can easily monitor the water quantity sensor for the relatively expensive. But otherwise, you will have to occasionally compare the miles that you drip in versus the quantity of the water with the effect and with all the base of the mil, mil, um, million parts per gallon of the water consumption. The other the other alternative to check the water level is fairly often, and someday you will run to the tank dry in which you have spent extra money on the sensor indicator. It's best generate, gener, um, generously sized water tank of five, uh, have a half a gallon to 1.5 gallon water gallon capacity. The tank I recommend with that holds over two gallons of translucent level of marking so, so it easily shows how the much water remains. Extra capacity water tank is up to very little space, but every good for reverse the uh, less frequently refilling. I recommend installing the six inch vent tube of the tank cap to the prevent the spillage from sloshing in the water. You also have to decide on pump location. If you're using a self-priming pump, I recommend that can, uh, you can mount it in the engine compartment. If you do not use the self-priming pump, you'll have to mount the pump directly on the tank and cover the, uh, or close by the level near the bottom of the tank. Uh, also, if you do not use the self-priming pump, the water hose going from the pump to the hydrogen oxygen generator will have capable of withstanding at least 66 psi water pressure. Minimum recommended pump pressure with capacity required to overcome the maximum gas pressure of 65 psi with the generator with additional 1 psi needed to activate one way install of the generator housing. Also, if you do not use the self primer, you will have to run an extra power lead lead, lead, lead back to the trunk and then for the sake of the simplicity, reliability, self priming pump is the best way to go. Are your in dash in dash indicators optional? We're referring to the following pick figure two to permit the easy monitoring of the water hybrid function. The one recommended the two gauges, the generator pressure, engine cylinder head temperature. Uh, I also recommend the indicators for the generator water low and pump on tank water low and power on. This can be also installed into the dash, um, vehicle dash mounted in the nearby console. Please know the in dash indicator are not required by the nice per um, nice perk if the within the budget technical expert. All right, so you have your um, cylinder head, engine cylinder head, check in, pump on, pump off, generator water load, tank water load, generator pressure. Monitoring the generator pressure and the um, um, the engine cylinder head temperature um, gauge allows you to develop the feel of the, how the system responds to various driving conditions. It can also be um, help tweaking the system and maintain the maximum performance of the economy. The generator water low normally remains un, un, unlit, and as well the fuel water consumed with the generator water level generally drops until the generator water low, level light illuminates. At the point where the pump should start point, pumping water, illuminating the pump on, and when the when, when the what generator has uh, risen to back to the normal level, the generator low level low light low light should go back out. At the same time, the pump should um, 
Stop running, turning on the pump on light. So under normal operation conditions, both lights should be illuminated at the same time. Both lights should go out at the same time. Any other light combination indicates a malfunction. The tank water low illuminates the tank water level to drop the one through third of the fuel point. And then you should think about filling the tank before long. The pour on, power on light should be lit. Remain as long with the water hybrid system as remaining operating normally. And the signal and light comes on with the hydrotonics tronics modules. So, so if the power on light it ever goes out, with, except for the system and the initially turned off, becomes intermittent, and the hydrotonics module is malfunctioning. The hydrotonics module will contain the electrical control circuit of the, the control and, provi and providing power to all of the water, water hybrid system electrical operated devices. Separate circuit that exists to perform each of the following functions. Provide power with the generator electrode form with the higher frequency signal with the creative the author oxygen. Provide the power generated with the coil from the very low frequency signal with the creating the power uh, Hydrogen and oxygen can, power, can control the power of the water tank with the V with the signal of the with the generated water level of the sensor and provide a busy terminal point for the distributing power for the system gauge indicated for the sensor. The generator electrical um, circuit schematic. Figure 5 depicts the schematic diagram of the generator electrode circuit with the output for the square volume pulse with the apply with the cylindrical electrode for the hydraulic oxygen generator shown in figure, figure 5 and figure 18. Referred in the file of figure three with the square wave pulse on, on and off the ratio of one to one. This is the pulse to turn on on uh, on for so long that it's turned that it's turned off. The square wave pulse is shown in the file of figure four has an on off ratio rate ration ratio ratio of the ration of three to one. This pulse for the turn on of the three times long uh, long is turned off. Generator electrode circle to figure five is capable of varying, um, varying its square wave pulse from which rate between one to one and ten to one. Or your square ratio wave is on and off ratio of one to one, and your square wave on and off ratio three to one. Each on and off pulse um, sequence is referred to as a cycle. Each of the new pulse uh, sequence keeps on the cycling on and off in the identical way. The, the figures show the three cycles on the off the pulse of the sequence. These cycles will all allow allow all were were allowed to the what time um, span with once a um, second with when referred to the pulse of the frequency three um, cycles per second. If 127 cycles were to occur with the time of the span of one cycle, then we would refer to the pulse as having the frequency of the 120 CBSs, or cycles per second. Um, signal frequency referred to the exact same manner, three com, um, cycles per second, and 127 cycles per second, etc. However, because of some, soul, some, some folks love to um, chain things in terms of today with 3 hertz and 127 hertz, the abbreviation hertz is used the honors um, Mr. Harris, a scientist who helped pioneer, pioneer the theories of the practice of use of electrical signal. The symbol K is used to denote the um, units of 1,000. The 300 hertz is a um, will be 3 hertz kilohertz, and 127 hertz it will be considered 127 kilohertz. The square wave created by the circuit of the figure five can be varied in frequency approximately 8 kilohertz to 260 kilohertz. All right, this shows your um, generator electrode circuit schematic. From the battery, a 12-volt fuse amp to the power switch. Um, the battery negative goes into the um, first, um, to the power no, rectifier with the, uh, or sorry, uh, rectifier um, capacitor, no, capacitor power on, one kilovolt rectifier um, um, power bus that goes to the electrodes, and then uh, your throttle goes to, um, through, th 100 capacitor, 2 can capacitors, uh, shit, a rectifier, 2, 7, 3, 4, and 6, the kinetic, um, capacitor, idle max, uh, throttle adjusting power on, pulse generator, square pulse, um, MQ set driver, um, rectifier, MOSET, transistor, pulse out, um, 3 rectifiers with the DIP switches and uh, frequency adjustment DIP switches. Some of these electroschematic diagrams are different. They like use different abbreviations. I don't know. All right, the square wave pulse with the determinant the amount of the currency. Um, certain within the generator electrode circle the five of the um circuit of the figure five. The ratio of the one to one very little current arrived with the electrode so the very, um, very little hydrogen oxygen produced for the generator ratio of the high ten to one maximum current reached for the electrode with the generator produced for the maximum gas voltage of the volt varying voltage the input of the penometer with the connect with the V with the ten K resistor to the pin three with the component with the LM seven four one cover with the circuit to vary with the pulse ratio but therefore controlling the amount of the gas produced with the penometer with the shaft connect with the vehicle throttle linkage enabling gas Ask volume to directly respond with the voltage chain to the correlating rotation of the penometer to the shaft of the regulation to the throttle positioning 
Um, trimming the pedometer, connecting the pin to the two and stick for the component with the LM71 one, the enable the price adjusting precise adjustment of the throttle input of the signal with the second trimming the pedometer, connect with the pin to the four and over the components with the NE555, enabling precise bolt for the adjustment of the electrode prepares. The, each of the generators exhibit, exhibit the unique frames of the electrical res, 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 renaissance, resonance, resonance with optimum, optimum gas volume created with the frequency optimum compare, um, considered among the different generators, several functions, factors to determine the requisite Resonant resonance frequency such as electrode side with the shape of the generator size, chamber size, and shape of the space um, be, between the electrode side coil parameters, relative to the position, pulse, amplitude, voltage level. A trimming pedometer connected with the pin between pins 2 1 and 2 and connected with the CD4069 allow the precise frequency to be obtained by various components of the dip switch connection to the back of the four capacitors, balancing the frequency with them, but can be varied approximately at 8 kilohertz and 200 kilo, say, kilohertz. Our general coil circuit schematic. The following figure six is depicted for the schematic diagram of the general coil circuit with the output with the square wave pulse that applied with the coil with the hydrogen and oxygen generator shown in figure 18. All right, the general coil circuit schematic shows the ground, the uh, transistor, your um, divide, your uh, 15 20 hertz diode. Um, these are capacitors, are 10 and, uh, strength adjustment and frequency adjustment, 10k. Transistor to the ground to another ground from the coil into the NE555 and divided it by the CDO. All right, this, uh, the generator with the circuit with the coil, um, coil circuit with the pulse and signal variable with much of the same, um, similar to the other uh, the electrode circuit with the figure five of the projection of the pair of hydrogen and the oxygen coil and it entails the total, 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 totality different operational parameter that does not author ortho hydrogen oxygen production of the electrode optimum for optimum operating frequency of the coil is much larger, um, lower than the range of the approximately sixteen hertz to twenty five hertz of the coil frequency array. The correlate the optimum operating frequency of the electrode circuit with um, the sense of the input of the signal to receive the direct um, the for the pin with three electrode circuit component of the NE555 electrode circuit the signal received the divided by with the N logical circuit the divided produced the output signal super response with the specific number to input the signal for example the optimum frequency the electrode circuit with the 19 kilohertz divided by the N logical circuit creates one of the output um, pulses of the every 100 1000 input pulses the output frequency the divided by the N logical circuit with the 19 hertz the signal with the receive with the V of the pin number two with the component with the N55 the NE555 creates a required square wave pulse the pulse of the seventh leaf of the PEM3 with the base of the transistor E93055 when they are not applied with the transmitted to the coil. The volume of the paragraph hydrogen is actually created with the coil precisely regulated with adjusting of the pulse of the wave of the amplitude of the trimmer of the pentameter for the associated circuit with the power of hydrogen acts of the octane booster. Therefore, the volume depends entirely upon the operation the bands of, the, of your engine. The power of hydrogen cooled for the combustion pro process except for the vol vol volume tends to reduce the engine's efficiency within the amount what in, within the amount what in that, what, with that in mind, the coil circuit should be adjusted only to be enough for the pyrohydrogen created to prevent the engine pre combustion knocking. However, if the engine oil operating temperature is running through the high side as it's determined by the, um, the um, the high, the engine head cylinder temperature and increase of the pyrohydrogen volume effectively lower than the temperature. In the dash and indicator circuit schematic, the operation optional da in, in dash and indicator circuit the schematic is depicted in Figure Seven of the total value voltage limited in emitting diodes or LEDs. Compromise uh, the in the dash indicators of some of the generator purpose generator pressure or uh, GE generator press um, gauge um, connect with the V. The hope of the restricted phase of the generator itself. The refer to Figure for Thirteen the cylinder head temperature of CHT. Gauge electrically connected to the sensor plate for the under the engine spark plug. When the generator water level sensor is activated with the water level, the 12 volt DC signal uh, is sent to the two pin detector, detector LM741 V with the 10 kilowatt resistor director output with the pin 6 and the trigger of the base for the power transistor E30552. Please the circuit to activate the water pump illuminating the power on the LED with the 12 volt DC sensor signal eliminates the generated water low. The LED, when the generated water rises to the normal level, the lever sensor opens the turning off the pump in both the LEDs. When the water tank level the sensor is activated low water temperature water level at one third of the tank level the 12 volt dc output signal inputs the water low at the led after the refueling adding water level level sensor output turning off the led or your in dash circuit and schematic diagram or it shows your generator pressure um your head cylinder pressure um gauge water tank low gauge um with a capacitor resistor and a um, capacitor uh and generate water low. Um, these are connected to the pump, and also the spark plug is hooked up to the car, car on um, the central, on the engine hard engine. Engine temp, uh, cylinder head temperature gauge. Um, the 12 volt volt C DC runs around the whole circuit and. Um, 
There's a transistor E3655, a pump, and the resistor um, on a capacitator, and also um, a diode LM LMT471, diode generated water sensor, tank water level sensor on ground. Water level high. Well, the water hybrid system is turned on with a power on LED line to generate an electrode circuit with a figure five that activates the LED feature. The power of the LED illuminates and usually indicates the electrode cylinder circuit malfunction. All right, let's build a water build hybrid system generator construction electrode. Since the engine requirement to dictate with the volume of the hydrogen oxygen gap, the generator must create the gas volume of the variable. Recommended inside of the large practical level of the reserve capacity, maximum outside of the diameter of the four and a half inch. If they've already determined the construction of the material used in the generator housing, four inch could be CBPC um, scheduled 88, 80 pipe, recommended with the minimum height of 10 inches. Maximum height depends on available space for the engine compartment of the boat. But the structural integrity limited the height of the 18 inches. Carefully check with the engine compartment for your vehicle to ensure the adequate space that exists for the generator insulation. Adequate space that does not exist for the limit of the generator height, but not less than 10 inches. Locate the generator within the truck and far forward for the purpose of the under on the dash. Caution: It must be um it must be palpable to obtain with three and a half inch outside of the hammer stainless steel tube and the water on wall with the thickness of the four tenths of the uh, to 63 hundredths of an inch at T304 alloy local shop manufacturers exhaust the and muffler system with all tube dimensions that include roundness that must be held within the 5,000 through the entire length of the design use long quality tubing if does the efficiency water hybrid system will severely severely degrade one after determining the generator height obtain the three and a half inch of the outside diameter stainless steel with the tube with the thickness of the 4,000 400 for the 63,000 the length of the five inches shorter than the diameter height of the generator standard alloy t304 stainless tube with the recommended for the electrodes the tube is used for the construction of the outlo outer electrode refer to the generator um the exploded view, figure figure 9, as 80 with the correction and with the construction. Note the following steps 2 through 4 will be used to determine the outside damage of the inner curl electrode with the um, they will cre we create the 45,000 of an inch gap between the inside wall of the outer electrode and the outside wall, um, wall of the inner electrode. This value is an ideal gap of the maximum, the most efficient in production of the hydrogen oxygen gas for the wire hybrid system. Multiply the wall thickness for the outer electrode of factor with the tube record with the result of the dimension. For example, the wall thickness of the 50,000 um, um, 50, of an inch dimension wall would be 100,000 of an inch the value of 90,000 of an inch value of the dimension of the A record with the result of the dimension B. Example, the dimension of 1,000 of an inch dimension B um, would be 1,090,000 of an inch. The subtract the value of the record of the dimension of the B from the 3.50 inches. Record the value of the dimension C. For example, the dimension B, the 190,000 of an inch dimension C would be 3.1, 3, three and 3 and 3 one hundredths of an inch. No caution. Also apply with the inner electrode. Um, also applies the inner electrode. Construct the inner electrode to contain the stainless steel with the outside down there equal to the recorded dimension C with the wall thickness of the four thousand four hundred of an inch to sixty three um four tenths of an inch of forty um. Um, 63,000 inch C304 alloy length of the equal to the outer electrode. Furnish the following figure, figure eight, the drill the eight, um, drill eight, eight, one, um, one quarter inch hole of space with a 45 degree interval around the diameter end of the outer electrode and locate the hole center 11, 32 inch of the tube edge. Clamp the large diameter of the wood dial with the rod side with the backup of the electrode while drilling. Debore the hole after drilling. For best results, drilling stainless steel requires the carbide tip of the drill a bit and light and lubricating oil. It would take your time doing so, not, not to overheat the electrode. All right, figure figure H of the electrode detail 332 of an inch. The outer electrode shown same dimension in the inner electrode one quarter inch every 45 inch degree, uh, every 45 in degree an interval, and one eighth of an inch every three every three eighths of an inch, um, and 11 32 of an inch gap. Um, Repeat the procedure for the depth stick with the drill eight and eight, one quarter inch low to the same um, distance end of the inner electrode tube. The further, again, the figure eight with the drill one eighth of an inch hole around the end of the outer electrode close to the one quarter inch hole. They located the hole center of the three thirty two inch at the top of the edge of the hole center space with the three eighth of an inch interval around the entire diameter of the of the hole of the after drilling. Repeat the procedure for the step with the eight with the drill one eighth hole around the entire diameter of the end of the inner electrode. To burr the hole then after drilling, they are cleaning that will residue from the both electrodes self soft clean cloth of the M E C K or acetone cleaning solvent. Bare stainless steel welding rod. Um, bare stainless steel welding rod T three o four alloy can be obtained with any welding supply store. From figure to figure eight with a cut two the two three inch rod length of the three thirty two inch of the diameter bearing bare stainless steel welding rod alloy T three o four using the file, file square off of the burr and rod ends. 
Silver bearing solder, solder in flux can be purchased in any large hardware or electrical supply store. Refer to the figure eight with the solder, um, solder solder one of the rods outside surface without a rod electrode position. The rod pair will allow length of the electrode figure two inches protruding the past end of the tube. Though using a severe silver bearing solder flux with approximating the solder, sol soldering stainless steel. Repeat the procedure with the step eleven the soldering of the rod to the inside surface of the inner electrode at thirteen. After the electrode has been cooled. I uh, have cooled thoroughly scrubbed with the solder joints in the warm soapy water. They use a simple brush, stiff, stiff brush, or bristle brush, and only th thoroughly rinse the electrodes with the warm water and dry with a soft, clean cloth. Costing you for the CBCP pipe scheduled in the 80 of the construction the generator housing. Do not use PVC pipe or CVPC scheduled 40 since it will not withstand high temperature or pressure as well. Do you not use CBPC pipes size greater than 4 inches? Size does not offer adequate safety margin abs against the rupture of the subject to the high pressure and temperature. Careful attention to craftsmanship detail of the generator construction is essential to ensure safety and reliable operation. Note, any large plumbing supply, plastic supplier must be able to um, supply CVPC Schedule 80 pipe fittings accessories required to construct with the water by hybrid generator. I recommend the United States Plastic Corporation excellent store that always provided with friendly and dependable service. The mail order, United States Plastic Corp, 1390, the New Bridge Road, Lima, Ohio, 4580013196. Phone order, 1-800-537-9724. Um, technical service one eight hundred eight two one zero three four nine. Customer service one eight hundred seven six nine eleven five seven. List of materials: one CVPC pipe, um, four and four inches thread pipe, nipple the length of the twelve inches. Scrubbed, um, scheduled eighty U.S. plastic sack number three zero three one four. U.S. PVC, um, U.S.C. PVC pipe, um, four inches length of the twelve inches. Scheduled eighty um, U.S. plastic number two nine zero two two. Only needed if the housing exceeds ten inches. One CVPC. The PVC one and a half inch pipe length of twelve inch the schedule to eighty plastic US plastic two nine zero one eight and two PVC um C PVC four inch straight start straight couplings schedule eighty PC and uh, schedule eighty US plastic three hundred fifty nine only when needed if the housing height will be um be ten inches. Or right, one CP, CPVC four inch cap scheduled eighty PC one CBC um, thread cap scheduled eighty PC um, scheduled eighty one eighth of an inch thick 40, 40, 24 inch by forty eight CBVC sheet only one inch diameter six inch length CPVC rod one pin one pint of CBVC cement one pint of primer one eight ounce of and can pump pump pipe joint compound. Or right, the step-by-step -step instruction um, direction, direction for the illustration. The CPVC is um, for scheduled 80 pipe with the U for the construct for the generator housing. Since one end of the pipe will require threading, we recommend purchasing the 12-inch threaded pipe nipple rather than threaded pipe yourself. Refer to the general detail of the U for the figure 10 aid of the construction. The CPVC schedule um, four inch schedule 80 pipe has an outside diameter of four and a half inches. The height of the housing of the 10 inch of the diameter the, during the procedure at the beginning with the electrode section following the directions on step two, then going to step eight with the um, if the height will go be greater than 10 inches, go to step three. Usually, the miter box at table is all accurate. Is sure with the awareness of cutting off the one of the 12 inch nip, um, nip pipe nipple to the thread of the end of the two and three quarters inch from the end, addressing the cutting edge of the same pitter profile tube for that. Um, file going to set up the you the minor block table saw with the um, square assuring a uh, sure squareness and that only cut thread of the nipple five and a half inch from the one of the thread end to then cut the edge of the same paper the fine tooth round file. Caution read the direction printed for the primer of the cement but it can be labeled the proper you for the products priming the apply cement as soon as possible to retain safe and reliable bonding. Do not let the primer dry before applying the cement. Um, preparing prime the outside pipe mating surface with the cut end with the five and a half pipe, pipe nipple that one of the inside mating surface of the coupling and, and, and apply an even layer with the cement with the prime surface with the assembly of the part allow the parts to air dry for at least ten minutes before going to step five. Prime the outside um, five prime out the outside mating surface over the twelve inch pipe with the inside mating surface of the coupling attached with the pipe nipple to apply with an even layer with the cement with the primary surface assembly of the parts allow the parts to air dry for at least thirty minutes before going to step six. In light of the housing, this is to be um, eighteen inch inches to go to step eight with the height is not it's less than 18 inches go to step seven um step seven use the mire box on uh, table saw with the sure squareness cut the pipe in the near and uh, there uh, assembly near the under thread end of the total pipe is equal to one craft inch for the high housing height with the rest of the cutting edge sandpaper the fine tooth rough to pipe raw file all right, measure the inside with the thread end cap securely with one eighth of an inch EVPZC pipe th uh, um, sheet with a drill press build bed. 
Drill one half the inch drill hunt diameter hole through the sheet with the use of the fly cutting of the cut in the disc with the measure diameter check with the disc fit the single leave with the end cap if the loose replace slightly larger than the disc if the if tight place with a slightly smaller disc be sure to drill with a one half inch hole thick um the first the new disc and cut the cut the second disc correct diameter with one half inch center hole all apply the primer with the cement uh, and the cement will do one strip of the each of the disc and join the disc together along well, the disc edge wipe the except for the cement out of the edge allow the disc air to drive with the air uh, on air hour before before going to step 10. 10 referring to figure 9 on bevel the edge of the disc for the fit with the curve the curve the contour of the bottom of the end of the cap be sure the outer edge of the disc may between the 132 an inch and 116 of an inch after bevel and cushing Caution electrodes will be attached with the counter disc from the contour, contour uh, accurately to assure the structural integrity of the water hybrid system. Our right, figure 9 shows the disc contour, the inside diameter of the thread in the cap, the 132th inch, 116th of an inch of the match on the contour in the cap. The caution, the end cap will temporarily thread for the end out of the housing and ensure the accurate alignment of the disc. Do not use excessive cement with the installing of the disc to prevent the lining of the housing of the cap and cap threads. Be sure to patrol and join jelly coats on the end of the cap threads. Lightly coat the threads with the housing end cap at the bottom of the edge of the housing with a gel jelly of any applied to the mate primer remaining surface of the disc and end cap with apply the cement with the primary air with the end cap of the only with the install of the disc. Sitting it firmly evenly with the removal of any of the cement ozone that from between the parts of the cotton swabs. Temporary thread with the end thread the end of the cap of the housing seating is slowly but firmly waiting with about 15 minutes with the cement and partially dry to remove the end cap. Be sure to mention for the inside of the end the unthreaded with the end cap of the cutting of the disc. Report and repeat the procedure of the proceeding. Steps eight through eight through ten and the unthreading the end cap. There is no need to apply petroleum jelly if any of the uh, to any of the areas unthreaded in end cap. Apply primary mating surface of the disc and end cap. To apply the cement primary air to end of the cap only with the install of the disc and seating the firmly evenly. Remove the cement and the ozo between the parts. Oh, 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 um, so remove any suit that oozes between the parts with the cotton swabs. 14. Seal the one half inch hole with the thread of the end cap of the um, disc with the electrical tape. Use the stiff brush or brush with the warm soapy water. Thoroughly clean the petroleum jelly from the threads of all other in, uh, areas of the end cap housing and the rinse of all the water, all the parts of warm water. Repeat step 14, then wipe the parts with the dry with a self clean um, cloth. Remove the electrical tape of the thread end cap. It'll allow the end cap to air dry with at least for eight hours before step 17. Complete the accompanying inside strip of the both ends of the caps. With the strips electrical tape cut, the wave the tape over the opening with one half inch hole in each disc. No, the cavity in each of the cap will be filled with epoxy, uh, epoxy cement to prevent the trapping of the air bubble. The caps may, remain, must remain with while the epoxy cure of the concentric level of the curved caps and cores the large roll of the tape will work well. Caution, use only high quality, high temperature waterproof the epoxy cement to fill with the end cap of the cap. If you use other cement that may be left to eventually vary with the generator. Purchase the high quality, high temperature waterproof with epoxy um, cement to fill the end cap of the cap. I, fully, I highly recommend JB Wealth will be purchased with the large hardware that auto support supply store. Comes being um, packaged in two ounce tube with one and tube rents in one tube. The hardener that will probably need with at least one package to fill the end cap. That you will have the questions about JB Wealth. They can be contacted at JB Wealth PBO Box 483, the Sulphur Springs, Texas 75483. Sorry, 754. Eight three phone number one nine zero three three eight eight five seven six nine six toll free one eight hundred five two five nine five three five thirty and um this is your if your attendance your generator details all right um. All epoxy cement um, cured with the chemical, chemical reaction after the hard to mix with the risen the JP well to remain viable for the, about 30 minutes. The, no, there is no need to rush with the filling with the end of the captivity. Be aware that once the cement is mixed, there's no stopping it from curing. If they, you have to remove it, adjust anything, and if it occurs, you you, you'll need dynamite to get this apart. Be sure to make it the equal amount of the risen and harder the, if using JB well. The resin and harder the different, different colors, one one black and one white, to avoid confusing them when mixing properly, you'll end up a nice dark gray color um, cement. And it's Accidentally mixing resin with the resin hardening with the hardener, you'll end up with nothing but a big mess. Mix about one four or four ounce batch of epoxy disposable container with a small paper cup with the slowly fill the active cavity to avoid trapping the bubble to the top of the one half inch hole. One of the end cap that's necessary to mix makes more of the epoxy. Be sure to um, have enough epoxy to handily totally fill with the remaining cavity. If not, purchase more more before starting. After the epoxy cure, it has very poor adhesion, nearly makes epoxy. Repeating step nineteen, fill the remaining end cavity to allow the epoxy cure for at least twenty four hours. Remove all the electrical tape from the end cap to remove the any epoxy from the above the top of the, top of the one half inch full for the flush with the dirt surface with the grinding scrape, scraping sanding with the doing whatever is required 
22. Measure the inside diameter of an inner electrode required the dimension of the dimension D. The securely clap with the one eighth of an inch deep. PVT plus the sheet with the drill pass bed with the fill cutter with the cut and the disc with the diameter and equal the dimension D for the sheet. Sheet check with the dark side of the easily with the end of the inner electrode opposite with the solid 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 rod. For neither um, loose nor, uh, nor 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 tight nor if loose, replace three with a slightly larger disc of the type. If type, replace a slightly smaller disc. Subtract the value of the two two hundred fifty thousand of an inch from the record dimension of the D. Record the new value of the dimension E with, for example, the dimension D with the three thousand three dimensions twenty one thousand twenty one hundredths of an inch dimensions would be two inches ninety six hundredths of an inch. The secure the clamp with one eighth inch PVC sheet. To drill bread, press bed, usually a fly cutter, and cut another disc with a, with a diameter of dimension E. Or read the direction printed with the primer, some of the can labeled with the proper you put the product with the after primer, they apply with the assignment as soon as possible to present safety, reliable the bonding, do not let the primer dry before applying cement. Applying the primary disc, remember that only one flat surface to each of the disc. Um, if it's joined the distance and a smaller disc on the, on the larger disc, the procedure for the steps 26 and 20, uh, 20, sorry, 27 and 28 will be you put the cut a flat ring with a CPVC sheet. Do not unclamp the sheet with the little dress best bed until the step of the 28th is completely secure. This clamp, clamp 1 8 of an CPVC sheet with the drill best and uh, drill press bed centering with the cutter of the one three inches from the end of the edge of the sheet, cutting one three and a half inch hole in the sheet. Drift the cutter to the cut of the ring with the outside diameter of three fifteenths and sixteenth of an inch. Reject with that ring um, so, so, uh, slides the easily in the end of the outer electrode opposite with the side of being the near lo loose nor tight. If you replace the ring of the slightly smaller inside of the diameter, the tight replace the ring slightly larger than inside diameter. Read procedure step 27 and to cut with the figure 3 8 and 5 8 of an inch hole in the 1 8 of an inch CPVC sheet. Repeat exactly procedures. Um, re repeat exactly this procedure 28. Apply the primary cement on one of the flash surface to each of the rings. Join the rings. Align the outer edges. Right wipe an excess of cement with the outer edge. Allow the rings to air dry with at least 30 minutes before going to step 33. Step 33. Grind a small notch in the inner edge of the ring with the just large enough to allow the rings to get clear of the solder rod and the solar solder to keep, um, slide into the rod end of the outer electrode. No, procedure step 34, same for the ring with the thread end of the cap. Be sure for the wrapping of the ta tap does not protrude below the edges of the smaller ring at any of the point. Do not overlap the tap ends if more than added. Just simply by the, butt the tape to the ends before cutting and continuing to wrap. You can, 34, you put the plastic electrical tape wrap, wrap around the outer edge of the ring and then they, they slide easily into the thread end cap. If the rings are loose, then more tape than if the rings tightly remove the tape. Further, the following figure 11 is a detail that related to the insole of the ring for the thread of the end cap of the primary only with the flasher for the threaded end cap of the contact with the smaller ring. Do not move the tape under until the instructed to do so. Apply the primary flat surface to the small ring. Leave the cotton swab. Apply the primary to the flat surface with the thread end cap. Connect with the smaller ring. Apply the thin, layer, even layer with the cement with the primary surface. The install of the ring assembly into the cap. Allow the parts to air drive to it going to um, step 36. Um, Our figure 11 is over the thread end cap. Details um, 360 fourths of an inch and a hole with a three inch and a quarter inch minimum. Inner electrode rod notch um, D and E. Um, so outer, outer electrode notch, rod notch and the 350 six and an inch, three and a half inch, three and five eighths of an inch E and D. Um, so there's your uh, thread end cap details. For the procedure, step 60, um, 36 center of the disc of the complete with the step 626 of the threaded end of the cap. Be sure the wrapping of the tape does not protrude with the below the surface of the small disc at the any point. Do not overlap the tape's end with the more tape that add the assembly, but the tape end with the before canteen with the wrap. Refer to figure 11 details related to installing the disc on the threaded end cap. Using the plastic electrical tape, wrap the edge of the large disc until the tape creates a snug fit with the inside edge of the ring assembly. Be sure the line of the disc with their knots and the lead offset of three quarter inch from the lowering knots is shown figure 11. Apply the primary flat surface of the small disc to the flat inside surface of the thread with the end cap of the even la layer of the cement of the primary surface with the install on the disc assembly with the end cap of the after line of the disc is with the notch is offset. At last, of a three quarter of an inch ring notch is shown figure 11 the way you the large C clamp with the lightly clamp the disc and the end cap allow the parts to air dry for at least eight hours before the ending is going to step 38. Step 38. Remove the electrical tape threaded end cap of the assembly. Scrape away any excessive cement that had oozed out of the flat inside strip at the end of the cap. Those, um, those area three will contact the bottom edge of the electrode through and thread at the end of the housing. Drill 37 and 64 of an inch with the hole um, through the center of the thread end cap of the shown figure 11. Note that the threads will be tapered in the hole drilled in the center of the end of the cap attached to the drain cock. Use the number four bit drill hole from the bottom of the thread end cap at the, the, the location figure 11. 
All right, temporarily aligning the electrode rapidly, respect the voltage to open the septum under the arm, the check of the electrode over the UKB and solve the thread end cap with the securely fitted the one firmly on the cap surface to make a jump from the necessary to achieve the correct setting of the electrode, remove the marking pen that makes a short reference to the line with near the top of the inside of the inner electrode, and another short reference to the line near the top of the inside outer electrode, align with the mark of the inner electrode, and remove the electrode from the end of cap. Procedure of the step the procedure to of the step forty one center of the inner electrode with the outer electrode do not overlap the tape and more the tape that is added simply but the tape in before cutting into the wrap. All right, using the plastic electrical tape, wrap the top of the end of the inner electrode until it fits in, and snugly into the outer electrode about one and a quarter inch of the tape the truth above the edge of the electrode then to facilitate easily removal. Do not remove the tape until the instructed to do so. Arrange the way, um, arrange the way solidly supported the thread end of the cap to the installed with the electrode with the epoxy cure, but it takes about eight hours to determine the leaving leveling of the curved cap of the curved cap of the inner core with a large roll of the tape works. The O once again with the cut, clean the bottom end of the electrode of the MEC acetone, even in soft clean cloth. Seal the bottom of the two holes and then cap of the strip of the electrode tape with the prevent and epoxy for the dripping out of the tape and the pushing of the electrode spot was um, poked through them after each of the tapes was removed. The mixing of about two ounces of the batch epoxy disposable to contain with using a small paper cup of the fill slot. Fill the slot in the end cup where the electrodes are installed all the way around the about the full half full half full level. Be sure to install the outer electrode first. Use the finger apply to the very thin unbroken and coated epoxy um, completely around the bottom edge of the rod end of the outer electrode. From the brand of the ex ex extended um, about a quarter inch from the bottom edge of the coating to the inside from the outside of the electrode. Caution: Small holes around the bottom of the edge electrodes help to secure the electrode at the end of the cap. The epoxy fills the holes and installs the electrode um, slowly in the end of the cap the slot, so that it's not so not to trip any air bubbles within the holes. 47. Install the outer electrode in the end cap of the electrode. Start at the end of the slowly lowered in the um, slowly in the uh, that the epoxy sufficient time with the smaller holes and drill the ram of the bottom edge of the trapping air bubble. The electrode is firmly seated onto the end surface of the remove the tape at the bottom of the end of the cap that is applying thin petroleum um, film of the petroleum jelly surface the tape of the wrap around the top of the inner electrode. Repeat procedure steps 46, 46 through 48. Install the inner electrodes at the end of the cap that you the light lining mark the top of the electrodes of the SA for the locating of the rod with the holding the end cap. Place about five pounds of weight at the top of the electrode to hold them, keep them firmly seated again for the end of the cap, the top of the intro to and then several folds. Several folds place them on top of the electrodes with the stack cover the hard cover books and tops will work well with the move the method to distribute the weight evenly with which can otherwise difficultly be covered the tape of the protruding from the top of the inner electrode. Even the cotton swab remove the excessive box boxy using with the eighth of one and a quarter inch folds around the bottom of the electrode and necessary going continue doing so with the epoxy beginning with the thickening about th about thirty to fifty forty thirty to forty five minutes of the household tissue with the disposable rag clean and boxy from the rods right and protruding with the end of the cap that from the on the surface of the room rounding surface of the end cap. Caution always you know, allow the epoxy to cure for at least twenty four hours the temperature for the seventy degrees or higher before removing the electrode wait for the otherwise distributing electrode before the lower temperature to allow the eight and longer cure time. Remove the weights for the electrode assembly that the epoxy has cured at least 24 hours. Remove the tape from the inner electrode. Use the number 40, 400 grit finer sign paper to remove the epoxy set residue for the rod ends protruding from the bottom of the thread end cap. All right, housing attachments. We're going to cut the tape right there.